Rex and Lisa Gray were still in shock when we met them in December, minutes after they buried their 14-year-old daughter, Amber. She died just six days after she was diagnosed with influenza A. She was definitely the light of our life, um, her and her brother both. Now, eight months later, the family has found a new way to keep Amber's memory alive. I gave up 17 and a half years nationwide. I had a career there. I could have potentially retired there and I took a step of faith. In August, they opened Amber J's one-way cafe and coffee shop in Redfield. Their church family renovated the building and every employee is a volunteer. What we started doing was keeping the tips separate and we started a little employee fund, start building up money so that we can get some employees hired. Even though Amber will never get to see the cafe opened in her honor, her presence is certainly there. From the color of the walls matching Amber's bedroom to her favorite Bible passage used to access the internet. It's um, giving us something to think about, but yet we're still, when we're thinking about something different, it's all geared towards something better for the community. They admit funds are tight since they're just getting going, but say their faith in God will get them through. We know this is meant to be here. We know it's going to go, and we just have to have faith that, you know, God's going to provide the funds.